Hi guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be a review on the Med Peel again, but this is the medium version. It's the Fusion Peel and it is a little bit stronger than the last one I did. Tips for best practices. Um, we suggest that you apply the Fusion Peel with a gauze pad to ensure that this is properly buffed into the skin and to promote deeper penetration. They provide these gloss strips to use. Mm, so apply one, only one generous layer to the skin upon first application to ensure that the skin does not over peel. And then what to expect is mild redness immediately following the process that will last one to two days and light peeling that will start approximately three days after the treatment. Okay. So the kit came with a few things, actually. First, it came with the Fusion Peel, and this is the Medium Strength Peel. It came with a Peel Pep Prep Spray, and a Neutralizer Solution. This is to stop the acid from burning your skin when you're done and a daily collagen complex serum. I'm going to start with the peel prep because this is what usually goes on first before the peel. So I'm going to read the directions on the back of here and follow them. And right now I have no makeup on and I have oily skin and I have acne scarring on my face, on my cheeks. Okay, so the peel prep says thoroughly cleanse skin. Apply to cotton pad and sweep across skin to be treated. May immediately follow with the peel solution. So I'm going to wash my face with a organic natural um, soap. Okay, so in my case, I'm not going to put the peel um, in sensitive areas. I'm not going to put it near my nose. Um, obviously not on my lips, not too close to my under eye area, and... Any other sensitive areas that you don't want to irritate, I would suggest not putting the peel there. And I'm going to start. They give you these little gauze pads to use. Um, so this is what the gauze pads look like. Not a real... It's different. Okay. So I'm going to use the gauze pad to apply the peel prep. And I don't have any makeup. I clean my face. And I do have acne scarring. So hopefully this helps a little bit. And they come with little pumps to use the product with. My cuts into my skin. Okay. Okay, so I applied the peel prep and on to the next step, which is the fusion peel. The directions for this says apply to clean dry skin and allow to process for six to eight minutes. Rinse with neutralizer, then tepid tap water for one minute. Um, may increase application layers up to three as tolerance builds or when a deeper peel is desired. Follow with appropriate treatment serum and moisturizer. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna apply the peel using a foundation brush, just so my hands don't burn. And I'm just gonna swipe it upward. Now it's definitely tingling. I feel it like all in here tingling, but it doesn't feel unbearable, which is a relief. It's 7.15, so I'm just going to check back in a few minutes and 
make sure I rinse it off after six minutes. If you can't handle the strength of the peel, just wash it off earlier. Okay, so I've had the peel on for eight minutes now. Um, I felt tingling and I feel... So I'm going to use a gauze pad to do the neutralizer spray. It says leave this on for one minute and then rinse with tepid water. Just make sure it gets all over. Now I don't have any crazy redness, which is really good. Um, I don't think it irritated my skin. It's like a tingling sensation, but it doesn't burn. And it's not like a scary burning feeling. I didn't apply it on my nose and I didn't apply it in any sensitive areas. So now I'm just going to go rinse with warm water and get back to you. Okay, so the peel is completely done. I'm going to use the Daily Collagen Complex Serum on my face to finish it off. It says apply to clean skin and follow and allow to absorb. Can be applied AM or PM, uh, follow with recommended moisturizer if needed, great for use following med peel, exfoliation products, or peels. Now it feels like a gel. So I have officially finished the med peel fusion peel in the strength medium. And I have to say, I liked it. There was no pain, no severe burning. I could have probably done another peel um, after my first one, but I decided to take it easy for my first time and maybe I'll try that next time. So I will definitely upload another video or um, updates on Instagram, letting you guys know how my face started peeling or how it felt, um, kind of give you guys some feedback on the after results. But so far my face feels great, it um, doesn't feel irritated, and hopefully it does everything that it says it does. But so far I really love this peel. By the way, I am also going to have a discount code in the description below. So if you are interested in purchasing, purchasing this peel, they have tons of different peels um, and facial products as well. You can use the discount code which is 25% off your purchase. So I hope you guys enjoy and thanks again for watching.